So I've been shooting the CZ75 Tactical Sports model for quite some time. I have it chambered in 40 Smith & Wesson. So I've been shooting it in USPSA Limited Division matches. Um, this is an example of a stock pistol straight from the factory. So this video is going to be a top three must-have modifications for the season 75 tactical sports so going into the first one right off the bat uh, going to go ahead and say that you should change out your sights so personalize your sights but this is an example at the very least of a fiber optic front sight to match your factory rear sight so if you don't change out your entire sight set Again, at the very least, like I said, change out your front sight. From the factory, you get your target serrated blacked out rear sight and serrated blacked out front sight, which is great for target shooting, but doesn't do much for action shooting sports. So the fiber optic really lends itself to faster target acquisitions. Uh, going into number two, though, is changing out your grips so you get these factory walnut checkered grips which are kind of thick um, and don't provide much traction so here's an example of a anodized aluminum uh, thin grip from m arms and they are available for purchase at fire for effect uh, check out that company it's been growing a lot they do a lot of work for this particular model, the CZ-75 tactical, tactical Sport, other CZs, uh, Glocks, and various other pistols. But uh, number two modification would to be changing out your grips uh, for something that is more personalized. So whether it be the color or material or the actual grip texture itself, uh, this is going to be my number two modification. Now, coming in at number three, even though it might be kind of controversial, is uh, your recoil spring. So, since I'm using this for, again, limited division and a major caliper, I do reload my ammunition for this particular firearm. So, I went ahead and changed out my recoil spring to match my loads. Uh, if you guys are curious, I am using a 10-pound recoil spring. I did install a thin polymer recoil buffer uh, just to see if just to uh, put in there for testing and seems to be doing very well uh, with that combination and the loads that I am using so um, these are going to be my top three must-have modifications for the CZ 75 tactical sports so you want to go ahead and change out your sights uh, personalize those for what you are doing. Um, change out your grips. So get the material that you like, get the actual grip texture that you like, uh, get the size that you need for your hands to better, better fit your hands. And then number three is change out your recoil spring. So depending on what you're shooting out of it, uh, tune your pistol accordingly and you're gonna have a fantastic shooting CZ-75 Tactical Sport. So let me know what you guys think about this video. Let me know uh, what you guys have done to yours. Again, these are just kind of like my uh, top three must-haves. Again, there are way more modifications that can be made to personalize this firearm to you, but uh, these are my top three, kind of like on a budget modifications that you can do right from the get-go to make this pistol um, a lot more personalized and a lot better for you. But thank you guys for watching. You guys shoot safe, shoot straight. Have a good one. Bye.